there if we get there. Regardless, Nairo, in order to have to get to James, he's going to have to get through Dark, uh, both wishes. But first, Dark Wizzy here. And you know what's worth noting is Dark Wizzy is the final combatant from New York in this top four. Yeah, yeah. that's wild. Dull or, Jersey? As the kids would say, OD. Jersey boys? Is that what it is? <laughs> that's the top three of Jersey that's left in here, and Dark Wizzy's got to fight them all if he wants to make it count. It's uh, Nairo, yeah. James, and then Wishes in that order, right? Yes, sir. The one, two, three, yeah. You can check out the PR. We just posted on uh, Twitch, uh, Twitter.com slash Mazarhand Games. Ooh, rising. I like that a lot. Close to the blast zone, but no cigar. That almost killed me. That was crazy. His up Bs are so good. I feel like that's a huge thing in Ultimate. Like everyone's so used to being able to free flow and just kind of do whatever you want. Kind of forgot about Mario's up B. Like everyone's <laughs> got to be reminded about it a little bit. Dude, Wizzy breaks out the wake up DP like he's playing Street Fighter 4 Ken. He's always <laughs> on top of making sure he's knocking someone off. Combo breaking, trying to go for the kills. He was just hitting a neutral. Wow, what a recovery from Nairo. There was so much crap flying out from Wizzy. Uh, f tilt? Okay, okay, f smash, sure, fair enough. You see Wizzy laughing. Yo, he even up smashed IRL. Wizzy, I was talking about Light's competitive mindset. Wizzy also has a very good one, too. Yeah, no, without a doubt, for man. Sure. He has a great head on his shoulder. Both these guys do. Speaking of a great head on your shoulders. That's, that's one of the best ones Ooh. in the game, if, in fact. Pairing when they have the invincibility is such a boss move, because you're not going to get anything off of it, but like it's, <laughs> it looks really cool. You're sending a message, you know what I mean? Can you put it on a job resume or something? Like, I think so. You put it right below, is able to use Microsoft Excel. <laughs> Proficient <laughs> in Google Docs. <laughs> <laughs> great with the great people skills. <laughs> Ooh, looking for a uh, nervous option for Wizzy. Does not find it. Good job. That thing with, like, as good as her Nair is, you can still parry the last hit and get a punish out of it. It's good recognition from Wizzy in that situation. Nairo faded back a little bit and then went in with the Nair, so. Yeah, I think he's parried every hit of Nair except the last one. Did he parry the hit last hit on that uh, last exchange? Did he? He's been, like, consistently anyway. parrying various parts of Nair, so, like, yeah. kind of hard to track all of that. Down it's it's like counting the, the vertebrae in your back. Like, <laughs> Nair hit number nine. People do that? Yeah, they have numbers and stuff like that. I'll, I'll explain later. Chiropractors. There you go. Yeah. Back though? Oh, what? The auto reticle? Okay. I mean, you want to look for like the Nair and trading it there and just it just drops you? That's a really good option. Yeah. So I like the auto reticle trying to throw off the timing. It's, it's definitely, a, definitely unconventional. It's, it's a very a, narrow option for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially so because uh -oh, I'm not no sure if you guys saw on the bottom, but oh my God, the So if Nairo went down there with the Nair, he would have gotten key. That would have spelled disaster for his recovery. But. Wizzy's got to set up that situation once again. He's down to his last stock, and he's not really in that bad of a position, all things considered. He's, nah. yeah, he's doing all right. I think Mario has like one of some of the the best tools. I think to fight Palutena on paper, at the very least. Like Palutena's gonna have to get in the area where Mario blows you up the most, just like right. smack dab right in front of him. Both these characters are, are brawlers, whereas you know Palutena does it more from the air. But where Mario's, it's gonna be. Uh, Better at counter hitting Palutena in the air than to say other characters are. Right, and on the ground, once Mario gets in, he definitely has big time frame data advantage. I think I think Pal is fastest option. I was told earlier today, so it's wrong. It's wrong, but it's told frame eight is the quickest thing she has to like throw a get off me option. Kind of. That was my Frozen, so if, uh, I'm wrong. Blame Frozen on me. Yeah. <laughs> but either way, Mario is obviously a lot quicker options than that uh, up close against Pal. So up there for something. Yeah, Nairo trying to get something generated right now. Has to suffer a little bit of a deficit. Ooh, going you, for broke. Dude, I, that's so scary. Yeah, man, because you forfeit so much advantage just going for that. Nairo bet it all on that. Wizzy made a pay for it. Very well done by the young Mario main. Dark Wizzy, man. Going up 1-0. And that was honestly such a well-fought game because I feel like Nairo was ahead basically the whole time. Gambled it in that final uh, offstage play, and then Wizzy, Wizzy turned it in his favor, which is really good. It's kind of like the same story of how Nairo was fighting Leon, where even though Nairo is dictating a lot of that, Leon managed to clutch it out. But if it follows the same tempo of that set, Nairo should be able to clutch it out over and over and over again, roll the momentum yeah. over him. Yeah. It's all a matter of, is Wizzy gonna give him a chance? One, <laughs> <go>. Stupid. <laughs> 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 okay. No, oh, geez. Wow, dude, that was, that, was, right was, that was the good hit in there for Wizzy. You know what yeah, I mean? Seriously. It popped, it popped him back up. Like, you don't want to trade with that one and have it, like, semi-spike you down. Down right. throw? See what we got? So I'd say Nairo's at his best so far in his bracket when he is back against, is against the wall. I was you know just saying when mean? his back's to the opponent, man. That back air is nasty. That too. When his back in back in general. Very nice. But Cooper, he's had his back almost this entire top eight. Like this has been a very rough ride for Nairo, and that's not something that we get the pleasure of saying too often. No, it hasn't been easy for him at, at by any means. Like he's had to sweat really hard for this top eight. 
Oh, God. Oh, dude. I, he barely missed that third up air. Forward smash. Dude, that's always been such a good move. Wizzy's been telling me. Oh. He's hyping that move up a lot. Yep. Good job by Nairo, man. Going deep. That's one thing that, like, Nairo, obviously, like, what he's most known for, I'd say, is, like, creative combos, like, aggression and all that stuff. And I feel like you don't really see that from Palutena that much. One thing that stays true to Nairo for him is how deep he can go for KOs. Like, yeah. He, he's, he's a renegade off the stage for sure. Yeah. Even if Nairo's not, like, hitting you with something, the fact that he's just hanging out that area and coming at you with such aggression and confidence means that he's going to force you to react a step faster. And nobody can, you know, react at the speed that Nairo can sometimes. Say, no one can out Nairo Nairo. You yeah. know what I'm saying? That's literally Spider-Man looking at Spider-Man. So. But it's two Nairos. Yeah. <laughs> All right, air dodge is used. Surprised he went for a Nair there. I feel like, I feel like since the air dodge was used, he should have flooded. Can't do anything about it. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. I think he just wanted a long last in the box to try and occupy space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fair. It's like Nairo's at 151. I, don't, I think even a weak hit of Nair would have done something to put some pressure out on Nairo. Ooh, Ooh. he pinged him back into the stage, too. You can see it. He jumped off the other way. That was super smooth. Yeah. I mean, he could have just done it the other way and got the KO, but whatever, man. So Nero has outlived this stock uh, much past its expiration date and putting a lot of work, bringing Wizzy to last stock, and now has himself two fresh stocks to work with here on his journey to evening things up. Let's think about that Nair that he did, actually. That makes him so good because he's been had so much success with the back air. So he's painting like he was going to back air there, you know what I'm saying? You jump off backwards and then you just do an air instead. It covers both sides. Super smart. Got to mix it up, man. Yeah, Facts. Man. You don't mix it up, you're just losing. <laughs> Instead of getting Chipotle for the fifth day in a row, get uh, Cordova. I told you, man. Wow. I love his follow. The way he looks for Explosive Flame, best part on it, so. Oh, yeah, without a doubt. Okay. Oh. Wow. She, you know what? She really gets into her pivot grab. I've never seen that before. Yeah. Down throw? Oh, the mix up? <laughs> she, like, really tries hard, you know? <laughs> she does, dude. Yeah, you know, honestly, you're right. She's uh, it's a little extra as well. Wow. It's supposed to Ooh. play, man. Taking it down clean. Two stock by Nairo. No dramatic screen or anything, but. Uh, yeah. Even Wizzy sort of hiccuped with that one. It's just like, oh, I guess right. we're going to get three. Right, fair enough, yeah. <laughs> all right, man. What are you ban, buddy? Yeah, right. Well, like, as the explosive flame comes out, like, all right, what's your ban, man? <laughs> what is it? Either way, we're going to uh, game three. Yeah. I feel like Wizzy needs the larger stages to himself. It's so hard, though, because Wizzy wants to get in and Nairo wants to stay out. So larger stages, it's like, uh, you got to pick your poison, though, right? Because otherwise, I don't know, man. It's, Wizzy's it's, finding his ways in by Nairo's overextensions and then also trapping up the ledge. So, like, these smaller stages, Nairo's just able to just press him out constantly. And the ledge play on Smashville was disgusting. So heavily in Nairo's favor that I feel like if there's a little bit more room to breathe, Wizzy can then sort of camp it out a little bit, give himself a little bit more time to assess the situation. Yep, but Battlefield will be the, the, the stage here for the rubber game in the best of five set. So let's see if Wizzy, Wizzy can uh, rebound and if, or if Nairo will continue the uh, downloading process for him. Yeah, man, and think, Wizzy's looked super clean on Battlefield this whole time, dude. Like, uh, throughout this whole top eight, through this whole tournament, actually, he's, he's been playing really, really well on Battlefield. So let's see what he can do. Yeah, but Nairo, on the other hand, has also been playing very well on the stage. You've seen him utilize flat, uh, you know, warp cancels. Very, very well with Palutena, and Battlefield one is obviously the best, uh, you know, places to showcase that. So let's see if that right. becomes a factor uh, later. Yeah, it's interesting too, because oh, hold on, hold on. Good jump out by Nairo, but he took his caught by the back oh, air forward smash. Wizzy, God. that was amazing. I'm telling you, he's hyping up that move, and he's he's making it <laughs> live up to the hype. Uh, what? All right, I'm talking about Nairo going deep. <laughs> Wizzy, Wizzy really going deep for that one. Nothing connecting though. Yeah, you never really think that. Oh God, <laughs> Nairo with the movement, the that spot dodge, so ball through black air. That was so sick, dude. Very well played by Nairo. You want to keep throwing that option out? Okay, you can get a few times, but I'm going to catch on. I just, like, I want just once to be able to see the game through Nairo's eyes for, like, five minutes. Take his glasses, man. <laughs> <laughs> I did. His eyesight is, uh, is something. Oh, my God. He just did it. That's so brave. But you have the shield to defend yourself, so it makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> That's just, like, real-life logic at that point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Trump there, a bit of a classic, but it's going to work out. Well, Wizzy doesn't have a lot of percentage on hand. I don't like it. Not good. Man, he runs away so much to the ledge after every stock. Nairo's caught on, and he's just turned the screws immediately coming off the angel flat every single time. Good. Again, great check with the auto reticle. Catching the jump in, at least giving him a, a second to, you know, buy some time, reset himself. Back throw here, Wizzy. Big opportunity for him. Pal is such a good recovery, too. It's just, it's tough for Wizzy. We saw him, like, kind of dominate light when he was in the disadvantage. The box is obviously a completely different beast off stage. Hold on. Oh, my God. Jeez, I think he was looking for a forward smash there, to be yeah. honest with you. Yeah. How cool would it have been if Nairo, like, predicted that he was going to get caved and then back aired him out of it? How, how, <laughs> how crazy would that have been? 
Honestly, like gross. the way he's playing right now, I would be like, all right, yeah. yeah, yeah regardless, that's about right. It yeah. is explosive playing that uh, meets its mark, and now Nairo, uh, you know, carrying Wizzy to the heavens with those up air strings. It's appropriate for her, right? Does she live in heaven? Uh, she lives in Skyroll. Yeah, that's close. Yeah, yeah so, it, so it's like the New York, New Jersey of the heaven. Close enough, yeah. <laughs> right it's over like the... It's like Philly. Yeah. <laughs> close enough, close right enough. Right over the river. Sure. <laughs> okay, air dot. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Line it up again. Yep. Yeah, it's just, she has so much range on that warp, man. Ooh, now we're having a hard time getting out of the corner, trying to force his way through with the riot shield again. But Wizzy, uh, you know, smartly answering with an up smash. <laughs> he really did it. That's I was, 0%. I, say, I know, right? Wizzy's a psycho. <laughs> he, he's such a Mario dude, like 100%. <laughs> wow. He is Mario. He, he, dude, right? he's so brave just shielding that. He's like he's a shield poke, you know? Forward air, hold on. Nairo feigning at the ledge, saying, I'm going down. Just kidding, I'm staying up here. Ooh, continuing to chase right now with the explosive flame. Oh, God. Hold on. Hold on. Hold, hold the phone real quick. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. I was like, I'm going to jump and just move around here. How's that sound? Yeah. Right. Now you're close, you know what I mean? He was literally <laughs> behind him. It was an attempt. <laughs> all right, Nairo. Down throw. Down throw. Ooh, all right. He's so good at that tech chase normally, but Wizzy's slipping out of his grasp. See what we can find now? Ooh. Yeah, no, 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 no. And he's out of the intangibility, did play a factor there. Dude, Wizzy's recovery has been amazing actually in this game three. Let's see what Nairo can find? Nothing yet. Oh, I feel like that was an opportunity right there for Nairo. He's trying to find. So doable for Wizzy, but he can't yeah. be throwing out rash moves like that. Oh my god, this is so scary Jesus. for both sides. Look right at now. this 170. Characters like Mario aren't living to these kind of percentages. What's the here? Up, up throw? Yeah, it's not killing yet. Jesus. Bro, no one kills with up throw anymore. Dude. Down tilt? Nothing. Forward tilt's probably... Yeah. Oh, so, all that for that? That's a, um, that's a forced error. You know what I mean? Like, dude, he was just there. It was so scary. They had the same reaction to that. Yeah. The same exact levels of disappointment. Yep. Everybody uh, <laughs> collectively letting out the Jeopardy, uh, or yeah. the, the Wheel of Fortune. Ba, 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 ba. I think it's, uh, it's not Wheel of Fortune. Price is right. Price is right. Price is right. That's what I meant. Forgive me. Sorry, I, I don't watch anime. <laughs> that's uh, <laughs> where I'm <laughs> All right, dude. Well, I, honestly, like, wow, that was seriously super duper close. Why does Nairo look like he's still contemplating a character switch, even though that the, the screen is already loading? He loves because he's a Ganon, dude. Heart, <laughs> he's a Ganon. Oh god, never mind. He's a Palu. <laughs> never mind. I take, I take it all back. back. <laughs> I take it back. I take it back. He's a Palu. Please forgive me, oh heavenly Palutena. Catching that trigger option, spot dodge. See what Nairo can find now. The ledge. Scoop. Into the back air too. God, Nairo's playing so well. Again. Yeah, and I feel like we kind of find ourselves in a similar situation of Light versus Mars, where you see a very stressful rubber game situation, where somebody you know goes up on top, and it's, it's the other person going to be able to have the steam to rebound from that. Right, right now, in the early stages, it doesn't look like uh, Wizzy's kind of recovered from what happened. I feel like if there's any opportunity for Nairo to really just run away with this set. It's this game. He just needs to start ending out the stock super quick before Wizzy recomposes himself. Because if we see Wizzy get away with a solid combo, he's the type of player who's going to take that. He's just going to run with it. He's going to try to make that go as long as he can, try and gas himself up with it. And if we go to a game five, I really don't know if this is going to be in Nairo's corner. Right? Back yeah, yeah, yeah. The back gets the job done. Then out comes the important part. Is he going to be able to get the extra damage he needs to kind of make uh, the landing spot a little bit more comfy for him? Nope. To answer we, that question. We censored that. <laughs> no censor. Not allowed to see that. Yeah, that, no, that, that no that's for, that's for our patrons only. So. <laughs> Premium Twitch channel. Yeah, <laughs> yeah if, you want, if you want the dark wizzy forward air, that's, that's $11.99 a month. <laughs> yeah, and the thing is, like, both these guys, the thing I like, like, Nairo's doing such a good job avoiding the big hits from Wizzy. Oh, God. Wow. That was, I'm not going to lie. I was not expecting him to do that. No, no, no. Yeah, it was a good mix-up. It was a very graphic game for him. Yeah. Nairo, he's done such a good job avoiding the big hits from Wizzy, like avoiding the forward air. I don't know how he got hit by that one, but he's been doing a good job not getting, like, dropping stocks at, like, 50 or 60 or whatever, forward airs or capes or anything. Yeah, he's avoiding it because Wizzy's not able to do the setups we saw him do on light. You know what I mean? Kind of wall him out with back air, steal his jump, put him in a really bad spot, and then go for the cash money yep. hit. Yeah, he's just kind of swinging for the home. It's like he's in batting practice right now, you know what yeah. I mean? Like, he's just kind of swinging for... Uh, swinging. Swinging. Swinging for the, for the heck of he's it. He's not swinging with calculation. He's swinging because he kind of has to. Yeah. Right. I mean, Palo is a whole different beast of box. Yeah, so, oh, especially re Especially recovering, you know. Back air. Oh. 
But again, the problem for Nairo is that he has been not been able to extend these leads much farther. Wizzy's been uh, doing a great job at closing great the trade. gap. There we go, only 44%. That's very easily make upable for... Uh, oh, why did he... I think he wanted that. That's uh, You know what we'll chalk that up to? Not great resource management. Yeah. Charged it up and just threw it away. This is definitely a failure. It must have been a misimport. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe he's up to some. If you love it, you must let it go. Yeah, part of Wizzy's <laughs> move, uh, movement with Flood, I feel like it's more important for him to have the empty Flood than to have a charge. We're not seeing it put too much work in when it comes to edge guarding. But yeah. when he cancels it to move around, that's, that's just fair. part of Wizzy. Yeah. That's fair. I like it. Down tilt. Can't find it. Wizzy's doing a good job avoiding Nairo's first attempt at the ledge, but then the second or third one definitely catch him. Here we go. Yeah, like that, exactly. Like he'll avoid the down tilt, but then he'll get scooped up by the nair. Supposed to flame, yeah. That's yeah, doing yeah, it. That's a three-one for Nairo. Yeah, that was great. Wizzy with a clean game one victory, and then Nairo just sweeping it on the way back. RG Nairo. And he's gonna stay right there. Yeah, just stay, stay sitting firm. Wizzy, very respectable fourth place finish for him. Uh, dropping sets only to show you James and Nairo. Very respectable losses. Yeah, God, oh yeah, yeah sure. man. Good on Wizzy. It's always fun to yeah. see him do well. Yeah, so. I'm, I'm glad he had a, not only a top eight uh, appearance today, but also through winter side. So that's cool. Wizzy, yeah, Wizzy definitely a sick player. Give him a follow on Twitter. He's always posting literally only about Mario. So if, you, if you're true. a fan of Mario, <laughs> it's really seriously, true. like, 